Assalamu alaikum friends welcome back to my channel so in this video we will find the value of x from this given equation so how can we find the value of x from this given equation so let's start our solution so we can write above equation as x raised to the power 4 plus x square and we will take this 20 to the left hand side so it will become minus 20 and it is equal to 0 now now we can write x raised to the power 4 plus x square and we can write this 20 as minus 16 and minus 4 and it is equal to 0. So we will solve this question with two methods. So it is our first method. Okay. So I will combine this x raised to the power 4 with minus 16 and this x square with minus 4. So we can write it as x raised to the power 4 minus 16 plus x square minus 4 is equal to 0. Now here we have x raised to the power 4 minus 16. We will write it in the bracket here. So we can write this x raised to the power 4 as x raised to the power 2 and its power 2 minus this 16 can be written as 4 square plus it will be same x square minus 4 is equal to 0. Now you can see that it is the form of a square minus b square. So a square minus b square will be equal to a plus b a minus b as we know that. So it will become x square plus 4 x square minus 4 plus x square minus 4 is equal to 0. So from these two terms we have this x square minus 4 is common. So I will take x square minus 4 common here. So this term divided by this term will be x square plus 4 plus this term divided by this term will be 1 is equal to 0. So it will be x square minus 4 and it will be x square plus 5 is equal to 0. Now here we have two solutions that x square minus 4 is equal to 0 and x square plus 5 is equal to 0. From here it will become x square and we will take this negative 4 to the right hand side so it will become plus 4 and when we will apply square root on both sides so it will become x is equal to plus minus 2. So here we have two values of x 1 and 2 which are plus minus 2 and here x square will be equal to minus 5 and when we will apply square root on both sides so square and square root will be cancelled out and x will be equal to square root of 5 because this square root of minus 5 is same as square root of 5 times square root of negative 1 so this square root of negative 1 is same as iota so here we have x is equal to plus minus square root of 5 iota so these are the third and fourth value of x. So here we have first value of x is 2. Second value of x is minus 2. And third value is square root of 5 iota. And fourth value will be square root of 5 iota with negative sign. Now we will check that these values of x satisfy our given equation or not. So our given equation is x raised to the power 4 plus x square is equal to 20. So to check first of all I will substitute this complex number here. So our equation is x raised to the power 4 plus x square is equal to 20. I will substitute here square root of 5 iota and its whole power 4 plus square root of 5 iota and its square will it be equal to 20 or not so I can write it as square root of 5 iota square and its square plus it will be this square and square root will be cancelled out so it will become 5 iota square will it be equal to 20 or not so 
from here it will be cancel out and it will become 5 iota square plus 5 and iota square is minus 1 and we have to check that will it be equal to 20 or not and it's square also so it will become minus 5 and it's square and minus 5 will it be equal to 20 or not so minus 5 square is same as 25 minus 5 so it is equal to 20 it's mean this value of x which is square root of 5 iota satisfy our given equation similarly when i will substitute here this real numbers so when i will substitute here 2 or minus 2 so it will also satisfy our given equation i will solve it with another method so here our equation is x raised to the power 4 plus x square is equal to 20. So, I can write this x raised to the power 4 as x square and its square plus x square. And we will take this 20 to the left hand side. So, it will be minus 20 and it is equal to 0. Now, it is the form of a quadratic equation in terms of x square. So, I will solve it by grouping or factorization. So, sum should be equal to 1x square and product should be equal to minus 20x raised to the power 4. So, I will take here factors x square and its square plus 5x square minus 4x square minus 20 is equal to 0. Then this 5x square minus 4x square will become 1x square and 5x square multiplied by minus 4x square will become minus 20x raised to the power 4. Okay, now in these two terms we have x square is common. So it will become x square plus 5 and from here I will take this minus 4 is common. So it will become x square plus 5 is equal to 0. Now in both terms we have this x square plus 5 is common. So this term divided by this term will be x square and this term divided by this term will be minus 4 is equal to 0. Now we have two solutions x square plus 5 is equal to 0 and here x square minus 4 is equal to 0. So from here x square will be equal to minus 5. And from here x square will be equal to 4. But we have to find the value of x. So we will take square root on both sides. So from here x is equal to plus minus 2. And from here x is equal to square root of 5. And square root of minus 1. So x will be equal to plus minus square root of 5 and this square root of minus 1 is same as iota. So these are the four values of x for this method. Hope so you will like this video. If you like this video please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.